Hi and welcome to the session. Today we will learn about area of closed figures. So first of all, let's see what is the area. The amount of surface enclosed by a closed figure is called its area. So here in this rectangle this much portion is the area of this rectangle and in this circle this portion is the area of this circle. Now let's learn how to find out the area of a figure using a square paper. Here we have a square paper and we need to find out the area of this triangle using this square paper. Now here we can see these squares like this one. So if we are given one square then the area of this whole square will be one square units. So For full square area will be equal to 1 square units. Now for the square which is more than half the area will be again 1 square units. So here let us write for more than half square area will be equal to 1 square units. For the square which is exactly half, the area will be half square units. So here we have for Exactly half square area will be equal to half that is 1 by 2 square units and the squares which are less than half will be ignored that is their area will be taken as 0 square units. So for less than half square area will be equal to 0 square units. So using these conventions we will find out the desired area. So let's go back to our figure that is the triangle. Here we have 6 Whole squares, that is full squares, and we have six more than half squares. There are no half squares, and we have two less than half squares. So here the area of the triangle will be six into one square units, as the area of whole square, that is full square, is one square unit. So area of 6 squares will be 6 square units plus now the area of more than half square is 1 square unit and we have 6 more than half squares. So again it will be 6 square units. There are 0 half squares so it will be 0 square units. And 
there are two less than half squares, but its area will be zero square units, that is zero into two. So this will be equal to twelve square units. Now let's see how to find out area of a rectangle. Suppose we have a rectangle ABCD with its length denoted as L and breadth denoted as B. Then its area will be equal to length into breadth. So we have for a rectangle area is length into breadth. So if we are given that the length of the rectangle is 4 centimeters and breadth of the rectangle is 3 centimeters, then its area will be 4 centimeters into 3 centimeters, that is 12 square centimeters or this can also be written as 12 centimeter square. Now let's learn to find out the area of a square. Here we are given a square ABCD of side equal to A units. So it's each side will be equal to A units and its area will be equal to side into side that is A into A square units. So for a square area is equal to side into side. Now if we are asked to find out the area of a square with each side equal to 4 centimeters, then its area will be equal to 4 centimeters into 4 centimeters that is equal to 16 centimeter square or 16 square centimeters. So with the help of these formulas, we can easily find out the area of a rectangle and a square. With this, we finish this session. Hope you must have understood the concepts. Goodbye, take care and have a nice day.